Now, the River State Governor, Simli Lai Fabai, has revealed that despite orchestrated sabotage by disgruntled elements to frustrate the fight initiated by his administration to tackle illegal banker in the state, formidable successes have been recorded. The governor expressed delight that the success will further be sustained, given the commendable interest shown by the presidency that has constituted the Niger Delta Monitoring Team and asked with uh, and taxed with the mandate to curb oil theft and illegal refining of crude oil in the entire region. Governor Fabara spoke when he received the Chief of Defence Staff, General Christopher Musa, who led a delegation of the Joint Federal Government Team on security of national assets and courts of visits to Government House in Port Harcourt. The governor said these saboteurs are not only attempting to disrupt the course of delivery of critical projects and good governance, but extended it to create disaffection within the thriving business in the state. The we are faced with a situation where the little that we are doing here are being sabotaged by some persons who do not want to see any good in what we are doing. This particular moment has created an opportunity for us to rewrite those stories. I can say here boldly that before this time, we've had a very wonderful working relationship with the service commanders here. And in River States, we have done so much in the aspect of combating the activities of illegal uh, uh, bunkery and uh, pipeline vandalization. And you can imagine what has just happened now when the federal government is now being part through the defense headquarters to complement what we're doing. I can assure you that it's going to be a total success. The Chief of Defence Staff also expressed the appreciation to Governor Fabara for creating an enabling environment with his uh, sterling leadership style. As General Musa said, his visit is twofold. First, is to assess the level of implementation of their directives towards uh, achieving the mandates of Mr. President in securing the oil producing areas and ensure that crude oil production increases. Mention something the issue of CPIRI. That is even one of the problems I'm having today. Because of what we're doing through the Navy and uh, the Air Force, which is also supporting us, they've all entered into the waterways now. The waterways around Boni is their track now. Kidnapping of innocent people coming from Boni to Port Harcourt, or some of them coming from, going from Port Harcourt to Boni. And as we're talking now, we've already started something. Myself, and the Office of the Secretary of uh, the State Government have already directed them to acquire six gunboats so we can hand over few of, some of them to the Navy so they can cover some areas of uh, interest. We have observed over time that there are gaps in the activities being ongoing and for us to be able to achieve the uh, uh, mandate of the Commander-in-Chief and President of Nigeria, we have to do things differently. And firstly, what we did was that the Operation Delta Safe, we made sure that all the security forces and other uh, agencies are working together under the Joint Task Force. They have their component commanders and their personnel, and whatever it is that has been done, we're doing it together in unison. We understand that that synergy is very critical to our success, and that's the first thing we did. Uh, secondly, the monitoring team and the infusion center the monitoring team is to also go around and see where there are gaps to be able to direct the operations so that we ensure that these things are covered. And then the infusion center's task is to also harmonize all the intelligence agencies together, gather all the information that we're getting, whether it deals with um, oil production or other acts of criminality. All together, we harness them together and then be able to take direct action, all in the course to ensure that there is peace in River State. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.